with you all about the new visas which are coming into effect on Monday, October 3rd. October 3rd. Oh my gosh. It's a Mean Girls like... reference. What date is it? Wait, 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 wait. Uh, October 3rd, October 3rd, October 3rd. Oh, October 3rd is when he called me cute. Right, that one? <laughs> so now it's obvious it's cute. Okay, um, so the highly anticipated new visa systems come into effect on Monday. Now, a little recap in case you've been living under a rock. Back in April 2022, the UAE announced some changes to its golden visa and visit visas, uh, which were yet to come into effect. So here are the updates if you apply for a UAE visa, and they all start from Monday. So the Federal Authority for Identity, Citizenship, Customs and Ports Security has launched its advanced services system for a trial run and the five-year green residence visa. So the, uh, the rules for that are eligibility for the green residence visa depends on salary and qualifications, but it's also open to all skilled professionals, entrepreneurs, investors and freelancers. Holders will be able to extend the benefit to their families, uh, family members, as well as they can retain their resident status for six months after the visa is cancelled or expired. Following that, then there's the U, uh, the new UAE Golden Visa, which has had an expansion as well. So the Golden Visa now has broader application criteria and it's open to students. Um, one of the key differences is in the visit visa. So there are three categories and all will be valid for two months. So it's jumping from 30 days. If you have family that ever come for 30 days and they're thinking it's visa free, now you have no excuse. They're going to need to stay for 60 days because that's how long their visa lasts. You know, you'll stay for 30 days because that's visa. Now it's up to 60 days for all entry visas. 60-day visas for those looking to explore job opportunities in the UAE. So it gives you that little little bit of extra time and also a 60-day visa for exploring business opportunities. That is brilliant. But if uh, your guests are staying at your place, then good luck to you. Why? I mean, 60 days, no two months. It's a lot. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God, yes. And at that point, you would need to register them as a co-occupant because they'll be staying for more than 30 days. So bear that in mind. If you need an excuse to tell your family not to come for 60 full days, what is the kind of, what is the sweet spot <laughs> for family visiting? Because obviously we all, a lot of us have family abroad and all we do our whole time is we talk to them and we miss them and we love them and their kids. We want to see them all the time. Then when they actually consider coming, it's amazing. And you're thinking, I'll take them to this place for dinner. We'll go for a walk. We'll go out to Al Kodro, show the desert. However, <laughs> <laughs> did you just like the list of places has Al Kodro desert? Yeah. Like, camping. Yeah. Okay, okay. You're cool like that. You're cool. <laughs> <laughs> Desert's like one of the key things. But it gets to the point that mm-hmm. like there's like that sweet spot of I love you. Like as in you want them to skedaddle. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like how long did your sister last with you before you kicked her out? <laughs> that I just said, uh, 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 uh. <clears throat> So before Breathe. we... Breathe. <laughs> uh, so uh, not really kicked her out. Like it was just hypothetical. Gotcha. But um, yeah, so how long did that last? Not really long. But yeah, I get it. Like... I get it. I, I know what you mean because I went through that with guests and that to me being super, uh, you know, like specific with where I want everything. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, what the sweet spot for you as in like in terms of who makes the cut of staying longer or like when is it? No, like how long? Up? So like the sweet spot is probably a week, a weekend and then five working days. Anything more than that in, in my house, I'd, I'd be too tired because Ooh, every single yeah. night, one week, seven nights. Max, because you have to go to work, then you have to take them out and rinse, repeat, rinse, repeat, rinse, repeat for seven days. They, however, they get up late, they go to the beach, they go to the pool, and then they expect you to be on top form when they get home. So there's like, I can do it for a certain amount of time. And then if there's kids involved, let's reduce that to five days. (laughs) It's a whole other, like in your house, I mean, like if they stay elsewhere. I... Marhaba. <laughs> <laughs> no? <laughs> on point. On, but yeah, if you have kids, um, you would rather stay in a hotel for your own sanity, for the sanity of the host, for the sanity of the people you're you know, visiting in all senses, and to even give the kids their space. Yeah, actually take my apartment. I'll go to a hotel. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Do you have a sweet spot for guests or are you just yeah, much yeah. more welcoming than me? Uh, no, agreed. Agreed. agreed? Like, literally word to word of what you said. 
A hundred percent agreed. Interesting. I wouldn't do anything different. We're literally the same person, Casey. We're the same person. Even when it comes to work, when it comes to like a lot of things, our social lives, our private lives, personal lives, yeah, professional how we lives. like treat relationships, exactly shopping, shopping. Yeah, we're the same. <laughs> <laughs> we are. In this case, we both like our own personal space. Yeah, all the time. Uh, guys, we move on to. Our-